Hey friends, Jib here with an exciting recap from what was a very busy and exciting August here at Lifeboat. New maps, new videos, a new original series, and more. Let's dive in. Episode four of the Rocket Family Adventures was released and it was awesome. After rescuing mom, the Rocket Family finds themselves in a haunted house filled with angry furniture. I'm not gonna give away the ending, but I can confirm it was spine tingling. Episode 5 is almost finished, expected to come out soon. Here's an exclusive clip. Thanks a whole lot, but you didn't free me. You freed my hungry book. It is a bright, sunny day, and all through the dark and dreary woods, not one cuddly creature is stirring. We have to find a way out of this book. Let's start by finding a way out of these not-so-spooky trees. The American Cafe map was also released, and if you like fast cars, fast food, and fast service, you're gonna love this map. Playing as the owner of a popular cafe, you can whip up classic dishes like burgers, tacos, and pizza, my three primary food groups, and use recipes, ingredients, and utensils not found in vanilla Minecraft. Fun stuff. Next up is Street Racer, a brand new racing map. Put your pedal to the floor. Put the rubber on the road. Some kind of... The city has become a playground for street racers. As a rookie racer, you need to win to make your car look slick and stand out from the rest. Just don't get caught by the cops and watch the sharp turns. You know how this goes. Become a roller coaster artist? Say what? Your local theme park is expanding and they need your help to redesign the rides and roller coaster builder. It's the dream job for any roller coaster fan. I get sick on roller coasters, so I prefer to watch them from afar. Just keep your hands inside the car at all times, safety first. Then we've got Fix It Up. This map sports 10 creative home improvement projects ranging from minor remodels to major renovations, neither of which I'm good at in real life. Or you can create your own designs using the included furniture items and construction vehicles. This one is extra fun for the players that love to build. Lastly, and fresh off the presses, is Buried City. It's been a hundred years since the apocalypse. Your job is to uncover ancient artifacts hidden in this buried city. Fight off mutants, mummies, and zombies to capture relics like a yo-yo and a boombox. That's it for map updates, but of course we've got a lot more going on here than just maps. Like revealing secrets of our architecture. Including an introduction to our newest supercomputer, which I've nicknamed Reggie. The key to an advanced Minecraft server is software, but for optimal performance, the hardware must also be up to the task. So for the first time in Lifeboat history, we've revealed the cutting-edge computer hardware that facilitates the mob AI and makes PvE so exciting. Definitely a video you want to see. Check it out. August also brought a brand new original series, The Inglorious Adventures of Todd and Woodrow, about a whip-smart talking donkey and his not-so-smart human counterpart, Todd. Friends from childhood, they had a pretty simple life crafting a world after their own hearts, but that all changed when a mysterious portal appeared in some uncharted territory, propelling them into the often glorious adventure of a lifetime. Episode 1 and 2 are out now. Finally, we thought we'd give you a sneak peek into some of the exciting projects we're working on. First up is this little mysterious clip that I'd like to call Instant Vertigo. Yeah, see, that just makes me feel dizzy. I also managed to snag some secret shots from a few upcoming releases, so if you like a good mystery, leave a comment below with your best guess to what these are, and then sit back and wait like the rest of us. That's it for this inaugural episode of Lifeboat News. You'll find links to all these videos in the description below. Stay tuned for more Jib and Motor videos, a new episode of the Inglorious Adventures of Todd and Woodrow, and of course, some incredible new maps. We'll see you next time.